Greetings, everyone. Lumberg here. Today, I'm very excited to share one of my favorite tricks, and that is how to have more than six fleets. So everybody's aware that, you know, you can you can have five fleets and you can get that bonus six fleet with VIP, but not everyone knows how you can get more than six. Yes, you can use a seventh fleet, and this is extremely important when you are trying to hide troops in Void or Frenzy. So, Let's look at how we can do that. So, and yes, you, you heard that right. That's seven fleets, not, and you can even do more. So the first thing you'll need to do is to, um, the, the, you know, before Void starts, make sure you do not collect uh, the Power Ore. The, the, the way to do this trick is to use the Power Ore. So find a Power Ore that's across the capital, this black earth in the capital here in the center, and, and find find a power ore that's far enough away from you. And that's extremely important. So um, I've already found one. So, you know, I've bookmarked it here. So when you port into Void and in into the enemy nation, you know, uh, wherever you are, look across the capital matter, find a power ore there, um, and then send a fleet. So um, in order to um, create a problem, because I can fit all of my troops into six fleets, um, I, I've artificially created a problem by actually... Um, removing Major Morgan to reduce my fleet size. So we are going to essentially send this saved fleet here. Let's go ahead and save it here to seven. Um, and uh, let's go ahead and send it. So you can see here at the bottom, it's saying it takes 38 minutes, right? So we'll send it. The, 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 the key to the trick is that the moment that you send that fleet, um, you know, that's, that's, and then let's now um, set up, uh, you know, a situation where, Let's assume that, you know, you're going to set up two rallies or you're, for, for my purposes, because it's not void right now, I'm just going to send my saved fleet to, to some of my neighbors, right? So I'm sending 15% um, that fleet here to one neighbor and send it here, whoops, to another neighbor, to another neighbor. So that's what five, let's send it here. That's the fifth one. And so that's five fleets. Now, if we go back to our garage and you can see here that I created this problem by removing Major Morgan. If you go back to your garage and look at your um, fleet army, you can see that, okay, uh, I've sent these 236 uh, units to each of these fleets, but I still have, you know, all these troops here. Now, zombies aren't counting here, but, you know, I could have sent zombies as well, right? So in Void, you're going to send, you can send uh, zombies. You can't send zombies to the um, Power Ore, but now you can see that I still have remaining troops here. So how do I hide this? Um, so the key to this is very simple. And once you find out, if you, a lot of people know about this already. If you don't know about it, once you find out, you're going to uh, be su surprised at how simple it is. But we have to either use a speed, so the 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 essential trick is the moment this fleet is gathering or you can hit a, use a recall button. So, you know, you can see here that it's been going, it was 38 minutes, so it's been going for, for two minutes. For demonstration purposes, you know, uh, you, you need this fleet to be active and, and available so that it's, it's um, the troops are gone for long enough. So people can use either a speed to get to their faster and then that gives you more time on your return journey. So the trick essentially is you're going to hit recall or let it go all the way to the power or and then hit withdraw. And the moment it hits it withdraw, you're essentially going to send another fleet. So let me demonstrate, right? So you can see here that this fleet is, is on its way. Let's just for, you know, for simply for void purposes, you want that time to be longer because this is how long you can be without, you know, removing your bubble. Right, so let's hit, we use fleet recall. Now let's go back to that save location. There's already a fleet that's coming on, that's on its way back. What you can do is go back and hit explore and you can send that exact same fleet. You can see here that now we're actually able to hide all of our troops. Voila, let's go back to our fleet. Now you look at your garage, fleet army. There is no units home except zombies, right? So you, you clearly saw that I had troops and even, so it won't display that you have seven fleets here on the screen on on the on the left top, but clearly you can see that the the, the fleets one of them is on the way back, right? If we find it, 
This is my fleet on the way back, one minute left, and then one of them is actually on the way there. So what's even more interesting is that you can repeat this. So if you have lots of you know troops and you have lots of you can you need speeds and you can repeat this, right? So so I can hit recall again and send one more fleet there. The problem is if I if I don't use speeds, then I'm not going to have that much time that I can hide my troops, right? So this is the trick to having seven fleets. It's a it's a wonderful trick um, that I am sharing with you today. It just needs a lot of setup time and it needs speed, so it's not very very uh, incredibly useful. But it's great, you know, if you're if you're trying to have an all out blast and you want to you know keep your uh, hide your troops or keep your attack fleet at home and just attack with the attack fleet so that when somebody counterattacks you, there's no, nobody home. So that essentially was my trick. Um, you know, I, I didn't want to waste speeds, but here you can see we only were able to have seven fleets out for, you know, the, the two minutes that was the return time. Um, but, you know, you can essentially repeat this process. So um, some people already know about this. Uh, some people do not. Uh, hopefully this improves your gameplay and that way you um, can actually hide more troops. However, my recommendation is at all times, you know, try to try to keep your fleet management at a, at a, at a level that, you know, is manageable, that you can do it with six fleets because it, it does take a, a few extra speeds and it does take that extra setup time in order for you to send it to the power war. That's it, guys. This is one of my best secrets uh, that I am revealing to you today. Hopefully um, uh, it helps some of you that didn't know it. Take care. Uh, have fun. Good luck and void.